Put some boxes together. It's the season of giving, and the Greater Lansing Food Bank, which supplies food to food pantries and to agencies that serve food to the public, is benefiting from this increase in generosity. So we get quite a bit of an increase in donations around the holidays, um, especially food drives and food donations, uh, which is critical this time of year, especially this year, um, because as people have noticed in grocery stores, the shelves are becoming a little more bare. Um, the supply chain hasn't kicked back in like it was before the pandemic. Lance says they typically get a lot of their donations from grocery stores. But this year, supply issues. They don't have as much on their shelves to donate to us. Make individual donations even more crucial. It's really important this year, especially for people to give food. Um, and that could be any type of cans, uh, things that are not expired, um, that you would serve to your own family uh, so that we can fill the shelves here and then get it back out to the public. Warehouse associate Roger Fowler says he has seen huge donations recently. This is a event that was put on by the athletic department. We'll probably end up with about seven or eight of the large watermelon style bins, uh, all packaged and we think it'll be north of 5,000 pounds. Lance says donations have been high since the pandemic began. So we're still in an uptick uh, over pre-pandemic uh, season. Uh, we have about 25% uh, more pounds and meals that have gone out the door this year alone uh, over prior years, and we're still not seeing that drop yet. Uh, we anticipate that'll happen um, maybe sometime in the, the first or second quarter of next year. And they're still needed. You know, the economy is still being rough for a lot of people. Uh, so even though folks are back to work, they still have a lot of bills that they're trying to make up for that maybe they missed during the pandemic when they were out of work. Uh, so while they're trying to pay those bills, we're able to give them the food that they need uh, for their meals and for their tables. But unfortunately, holiday giving does not last all year. We do see uh, food and monetary donations drop after the holidays, and that's another time frame that we would love to have people think of us during those, you know, those first few quarters of 2022. Um, when uh, the giving season starts to go away, but the need doesn't go away. Food collected by the Greater Lansing Food Bank goes to food pantries and meal sites across mid-Michigan in Clare, Clinton, Eaton, Ingham, Isabella, and Shiawassee counties. Reporting, I'm Margaret Cahill, Fox 47 News.